Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie. This is Angel, and we love you. I'm the queen of stars of all the universe. Yes, I am. Welcome to your weekly horoscope. I send you love today. This week the sun is in the sign of Taurus. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. The moon will travel and visit the signs of Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius. And the big, big news this week, Thursday, Mercury, planet of communication in the sign of Taurus will start going backwards, retrograding. And for quite a long time, all the way to May 22nd. That means that all communication will slow down and somehow it will put the brakes on the financial wheeling dealing and everything will go slower and we have to be careful with spending and buying and selling. It's better to delay after the 22nd of May, like start on the 23rd. You'll see also in the political world, more sanity and the truth coming more and more clear and the light coming more and more conquering the darkness but it's all good it's always for the better good a very good time right now to reevaluate the state of our love life our finances our career even our health and it's a good time to take time off to do some soul research while mercury is going backwards about what we are who we are what we want and what we would like to manifest in the future in love romance health career and if you have something important to do, to sign, to sell, to pitch, to buy, do it on Wednesday. Next Wednesday is absolutely amazing because somehow the Taurus sun will make a very productive aspect to the moon and Capricorn that day. And that means everything goes. It's like success guaranteed. On Friday, Venus, planet of love and passionate Aries will enter also slow moving Taurus, joining Mercury and also the sun. That will sort of make things easier for all of us, softer, especially dealing with relationships and security matters. The tendency to say, it's mine, it's mine, it's mine, will be very strong, so it's very important to avoid being possessive. This week, the more we give, the more we receive. The more we want to take it, the more we lose it. Also, it's Orthodox Good Friday on Friday. So let me start now with you, Taurus. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Mercury retrograde in your house of self and Venus also your ruler entering your sun on Friday. Bring a new beginning in professional matters one way or the other. You feel generous and compassionate, sensitive, and it's good. Getting involved in a charity project, helping some friends could be quite rewarding. Everything in your life is now getting better and better. It's changing. You can't stop the current. The ocean is bringing you into a new destiny. You attract a fresh start that will bring well-deserved success sooner than later. Gemini, Cancer people really are our lives. And on the weekend, you should relax and definitely take some walks near nature, near the ocean, near a lake. Touch up the trees. That's what you need now. Your magical color green, lucky numbers 11 and 45. Gemini, Mercury retrograde in your spiritual sector because that's your master. And also Venus, planet of love, joining Mercury on Friday. Bring enlightenment in your belief system and also new visions of how you could do things. You can see in the future somehow. Take a break from your usual routine and try to see how you could revamp everything. Helping other people is very good for some times, but it's also good, especially with Mercury retrograde, your master, to say no sometimes and keep secrets. Remain emotionally detached in career for now. Just do your research because you are moving into a new path that will bring you the answers. Higher education, travel are favored. Finances need your attention. On the weekend, express your feelings all the way. Pisces, Libra, and Sagittarius really care. And you could get a surprise also for somebody just like that. 
kiss. Your magical color, white lucky numbers, three, six. Cancer, Cancer, Mercury retrograde in your social center, and also Venus, Planet of Love, joining Mercury on Friday, will bring you a chance to make a fresh start somehow. You have more clarity about who you are, about what you want, about your friendships, partnerships, and also dealing with shared resources, some other people's money. But it's all good. Make sure you know your rights in tax issues, legal affairs. A good time also to make plans and strategies and plant seeds in your career. Something big is in the horizon and you need to really have faith. What is most important this week is truly, truly to also spend more time with loved ones and concentrate on the goals you would like to achieve in the near future. And it's important also to meditate and to listen to what's going on around you and just go with the invisible energies rather than the material energies and it will be fine. By the weekend, it's like you'll find a solution to a dilemma and you'll be quite proud of yourself. Your magical color is red, lucky numbers 9 and 36. Leo, Mercury retrograde in your career sector and also Venus joining Mercury on Friday will bring more clarity about your professional relationships and maybe your career goals also will get answers. Look beyond the immediate and shoot for the stars. Group activities are favored. The focus is also on universal appeal, social activities, and your wishes in your heart, in your mind that you want to accomplish. Focus on that. And on the weekend, it's time to pamper yourself, beautiful lion. You need like, mm, see a massage, or get a little beauty treatment, whatever makes your heart happy. Your magical color gold, lucky like numbers, eight and 44. Virgos, Mercury, your ruler, retrograde in your karmic sector and also Venus planet of love joining Mercury on Friday bring a new exciting beginning somehow your intuition is right on target don't listen to your head listen to your gut your daily routine and lifestyle is undergoing some important transformation and it's all good don't resist don't look back reinvent yourself it's time now make sure you also you know what you want a friend may surprise you with a good news or some invitation. You should say yes another weekend. Do take care of your health. Be in shape. One, two, three. Your magical color move, lucky numbers five, 14. Libra, Mercury retrograde in your shared resources sector and Venus, planet of love. Your ruler joining Mercury on Friday will make you very creative, magnetic, spiritual, deep. Somehow nature, children, flowers, trees inspire you. You may have questions about your goals, your relationships, and your future. Expect to receive precious, precious information that will help you a lot from somebody in your career. So listen and watch it out. You may also feel a little unpredictable these days and also mellow and it's good. Just go with the flow, you are moving forward. On the weekend, it's sweet, sweet and cozy. Your dreams also are prophetic, so take notes in the morning. Your magical color lilac, lucky numbers, two and 11. Scorpios, Mercury, retrograde in your relationship sector and Venus, joining Mercury on Friday will bring you closer to your home and family and friends. Do you feel a little stubborn these days? It's very good and it's okay. Use your power, your free will and power, and your determination to make things happen. Nobody could do this right now. Some of you may reconnect with an old flame that you thought was over, but it's not. One way or the other, be flexible in love, in career, in finances, and you'll get your way. You need also to stand your ground now in a certain negotiation at work, it's better also to finalize everything than before, like after the 22nd of May. On the weekend, pamper yourself. You need a little lovey lovey. And your magical color fuchsia, lucky numbers eight and 22. Sagittarius, Mercury retrograde in your work sector brings you power and optimism and new instinct about where you want to live, your relationships with your family, everything to do with siblings and neighbors and Venus also joining. Mercury on Friday brings some kind of enlightenment about those issues. You have more freedom of action in career and 
personal life somehow. It, but it's it, things just won't be the way you thought they would be, but better. A good time to reflect on what really matters in your life and how you can make it better and better. And you need to have confidence. It's very important. Don't sell out. Just fight what's right for you. If you're in love, you also can make a very good decision to commit to something serious in the next couple of weeks. And on the weekend, you will receive a lot of compliments. So just say thank you, thank you, because you are pretty, pretty. Your magical color, fuchsia, like in numbers one and ten. Capricorn, Mercury retrograde in your creative sector brings you good financial news. And also Venus entering your group activity on the Friday somehow gives you a little bit of a mm, spark of energy. And it's, it increases your individuality for some reason, your leadership. You get along very, very well with friends and co-workers and even with the family. In career, you know what you are definitely go, getting yourself in and you're getting in more and more power. Just go with the flow and listen to what people have to say. But for sure you are now on the right track. In your personal life, some of you may make some very heavy decisions. Don't do nothing before the end of May. Movies, books, music will inspire you a lot and even some friends could really do something for you on the weekend. So enjoy my beauty, enjoy your magical color, silver, lucky numbers 2 and 11, Aquarius, Mercury retrograde in your home sector and also Venus joining Mercury on Friday gives you a big boost of energy, enthusiasm and more awareness about your self-image, your worthy about yourself, your values, your talents, and also how's your health. Why don't you check how people perceive you? You'll, that's going to give you a little cue about like who you are. Remember that others perceive only what they are. So what you do is just learn about who they are. It's not about you, it's actually about them. But it's fun to play with these things this week. Get ready also for changes in your appearance and lifestyle. It's happening this week and on the weekend, spend time alone, meditate and make plans for the future. The magical color, violet, lucky numbers 5 and 23. Pisces, Mercury, retrograde in your communication sector and also Venus, planet of love, joining Mercury on Friday, puts you on a pedestal and in contact with your higher self somehow and it helps you to look to your inner motivations and ideals. What do you want to do and what really motivates you? This is the reflection of the week. The wizard in you will come out. How do you feel about your personal power? Where do you want to be in a year from now? Make plans about your goals and wishes because the universe is listening. On the weekend, think greatness. Your magical color blue like numbers 7 and 28. Aries, Mercury, retrograde in your financial sector and also Venus joining Mercury on Friday. Bring enlightenment about relationships, creativity and also strong leadership at work. People smile at you all week. You feel compassionate and want to help other people and it brings you luck when you do. Use the element of timing in your career. A good time also to revise your goals and dreams especially in your love life, in your personal life, in your family life. Do things slowly to avoid mistakes and on the weekend, relax, relax, relax. Your magical color, orange, lucky number six and 11. And now is the wizard affirmation of this very, very interesting, sort of like hmm, going from fast to slow week. What we focus on with our thoughts and feelings is what we attract in our life. I always say focus on the sun, not the clouds. You'll make more of it. Love you guys. Be good now. Go slow like the turtle, not like the rabbit. The rabbit now. Bye-bye. Turtle. Doop, 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 doop. Be good now.